In this video we are going to talk about 7 things to know about Shetland Sheepdogs. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. The Shetland Sheepdog is a little lively, very obedient and agile herding dog native to Scotland's remote Shetland Islands. These dogs, sometimes known as Shelties, have a remarkable resemblance to their larger cousins, the Collie. A male Shetland Sheepdog is termed a dog, whereas a female is referred to as a bitch. Number 7. Shelties aren't miniature Collies. It's not that we have anything against our beautiful Collie cousins at all. But Lassie, you're really taking the spotlight away from us with your brilliance. For the time being, would you mind standing back and allowing the Shelter to have his way? In his own right, he's a pretty kind and affectionate dog. Shelties were formerly known as Shetland Collies because of their striking resemblance to rough Collies in look when the breed was initially recognized as a distinct entity. The two breeds, on the other hand, are descended from distinctly different lineages. It was in the 1700s when a Scandinavian Spitz type breed was brought to Scotland and developed into the Sheltie we know today. Later, as a result of crossbreeding with Collie strains, they grew to resemble Lassie more and more. Later on, miniaturization was achieved through cross-breeding with Pomeranians, and potentially even Papillons and Corgis. It's generally at this moment that the puzzled Lassie lover backs away from me, murmuring something about wanting to stroke my dog and not much else. Number 6. Shelties are double-coated dogs, which means they have two coats. Brushing your pet's coat is a vital element of your pet's daily maintenance regimen. It is essential that you become familiar with the art of grooming your Sheltie in order to remove the loose undercoat and dead angle the outside coat. Grooming is a responsibility that must not be neglected at any cost. Not only will your furniture become to resemble your dog, but your dog will also become extremely passive-aggressive toward you until you can get his fur under control. It takes a lot of time and effort to groom your dog once a week, so it's best suited for people who are conscientious, loving, and don't mind getting a little fluff on their clothes. If you decide to take your shelter to a professional groomer, make sure you can afford regular visits and try to remain with the same groomer so that your shelter develops accustomed to them and feels comfortable with them. Having a stranger groom your shelter can be an inconvenient and frightening experience for the pooch, you understand. Number 5. Shelties are the sixth most intelligent dog breed. Shelties are incredibly intelligent dogs. Despite the fact that each individual differs, they all appear to possess a level of alertness that is unequaled by most other breeds. Shelties rank sixth among all dog breeds in terms of intelligence, and they are the most intellectual of the small dog breeds. As a result, what does this mean for the connection between you and your Sheltie? Because to their rapid learning ability, they may master new commands in as few as five repetitions while also excelling at stunts and agility. Training your Sheltie when he is a puppy may be really beneficial and a lot of enjoyable. After spending some time with a Sheltie, you'll notice that many other breeds appear out of place. Having a smart Sheltie dog, on the other hand, comes with a lot of responsibilities. It implies that you must keep him occupied, which includes daily walks with lots of smells, time off the leash, socialization with other dogs and humans, and games around the house, among other things. Sheltie games might be difficult to master because they do not play fetch as frequently as other breeds of dogs. They, on the other hand, enjoy herding. Number 4. Shelties are excellent natural alarm dogs. Because of their working dog heritage on the Shetland Islands, Shelties have been selectively bred for specific characteristics. These characteristics include alertness, intellect, acute eyes, and barking, all of which combine to create a highly motivated alarm dog. These characteristics can still be found in Shelties kept as pets today. In order to keep their homes safe, they must keep an eye out. For potential risks such as uninvited guests, barking dogs from the next-door neighbors, prowling cats, and, of course, the mailman. Because the Sheltie is not a guard dog, he will not attack anyone. Alarm dogs do nothing more than alert your awareness, often to your surprise, of unusual behavior. He'll keep sounding the alarm for a while longer, unless you give him the all-clear to stop. A quick, crisp, forceful SHHH should be used every time your Sheltie barks, and you will notice an improvement if you do this on a consistent basis. 
In order to reduce his compulsion to call your attention to every speck of dust that drifts by the window, try providing him with different forms of mental stimulation. Getting out and about in the morning is a great way to start the day. In addition to culinary chews and play chews, providing him with these can be a wonderful distraction. Make an effort to think outside the box and see what jobs you can train your shelter to perform at home, lest he decide to designate himself as watcher of cats and listener of all noises, resulting in excessive and strident barking. Number 3. Shelties are vocal dogs. Shelties, in addition to their intense need to alert bark, communicate with humans through a variety of sounds that sound to us like singing, conversing, and yowling. That it's usually always targeted in your general direction just adds to the charming nature of the gesture, leaving you with no doubt that your dog is truly attempting to communicate with you is another plus. Some Shelties are more vocal than others, depending on their temperament. Howard is the powerful, silent kind, at least according to Shelta standards. Piper, on the other hand, is our vocal performer. He has long since determined that he must howl when the answering machine rings in order for us not to miss an important phone call. Besides singing when he yawns, he is also known to use terms such as rowl, rar, and ya to express himself. Number 2. Shelties have a wonderful temperament. Overall, Shetland sheepdogs are often devoted, loving, loyal, sensitive, and sensitive little fellows. Everyone's favorite canine companion has his or her own distinct personality, but the Sheltie breed disposition is known for producing a sweetness that can be found in every Sheltie you encounter. The submissive disposition of the Sheltie, as well as his intelligence and desire to please, contribute to his temperament. When you're out and about, he wants to be with you at all times, defending you from potentially dangerous invaders like the possum hiding by the porch. As a result, he is eccentric, cunning, and alert even during the rolling 3 a.m. rainstorm. Excellent canine. Beware though, because an anxious Sheltie can be apprehensive. Sheltie's nervousness is frequently caused by a lack of socialization when still in puppyhood. A puppy's fear threshold is extremely high between the ages of 4 and 10 weeks, which means that he will put himself in dangerous circumstances with little regard for his own safety. Aside from providing him with plenty of opportunities to become emotionally attached to people, who would otherwise pose a threat, you know, as an enormous meat-eating predator ten times his own height and weight. A dog who does not learn that humans are kind and safe will spend the rest of his life being on the lookout for people he does not know. Additionally, worried Shelties find it difficult to acquire a custom to youngsters, who are, as you will agree, the oddest and most unpredictable humans on the planet. Number 1. Shelties need daily exercise. Shelties, who were raised to be active working dogs, require at least 30 to 60 minutes of daily outside exercise. Allow plenty of opportunity for your shelter to explore, sniff, socialize, and run off the leash. You can also provide extra mental and physical stimulation for your shelter by playing herding dog games with them in the house. You'll be familiar with zoom eyes if you have two or more shelties. Zoom eyes are a favorite game among shelties. Shelties have a lot of rapid energy, so give them as much exercise as possible. However, unlike certain breeds, they will not go climbing or jogging for hours. Howard once decided that he'd had enough exercise for the day when we were attempting to climb a large hill in the woods. He sat defiantly in the middle of the stairs and refused to move until we agreed that he could have some extra chow when we got home. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.